So I just got back from Berlin, where I was at the Zeiss Seeing Beyond conference. One of the about 2,000 delegates from all over the world invited to experience the latest technology that Zeiss are producing. So in this video, I'm going to talk about three specific things. We've got Zeiss's newest lens technology. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of Team Zeiss, I introduce you now to Zeiss Smart Life Lenses. And we're going to talk about all the ways that they came about designing that. We're going to talk about the importance of UV protection. And we're going to talk about a new piece of kit, which we've got coming really soon, which is going to change the way that you buy glasses. So let's get right into it. Uh, as we entered the Seeing Beyond conference hall, we were greeted with a huge area where there are all these displays, each exhibiting a component of what went into the new Smart Life lenses. So I'm going to tell you what Smart Life is. We're going to get to that in a little while, but let's start with the premise. The premise is that the amount of time we spend on digital devices is increasing all the time and it's rapidly accelerating. We had experts there from Google and Facebook who were talking about the average smartphone user's day. It's crazy to think how quickly they've become such a huge part of our lives, but they present a very different kind of challenge to our vision than we've been used to at any time in the past. Zeiss have found that out from these experiments that they've done. So we looked at, for example, a head tracking technology that they've developed. These are glasses that you can wear, which tracks the movement of your head as you're going through your average day. So they can see how you move around, how you position your head, and how you experience really the world around you. And on top of that, they also had eye tracking technology. So not only could they see the way that people were moving around, they could also see how they were looking at the same time. What they gleaned from that is that we actually move our heads a lot less than you would expect, and we move our eyes way more than you would expect when we're using a smartphone. If you think about that, it's, uh, it's pretty clear why that would be. When we're on a smartphone, we tend to hold it at a specific angle, and we're generally sc scrolling with our thumb. So we tend to scan there, and then we look around with our peripheral vision. When we're reading a book, it tends to be much more head oriented So the way that we read now with the advent of digital screens is uh, completely different. But what Zeiss also found out from these studies is that we are using our peripheral vision a lot more than we did in the past. Apparently, smartphone users have a wider field of view when they're looking around at the world. So we'll, we'll be scanning from our phone to the outer environment. And lens technologies in the past didn't really cater for that quick switching from one to the other and the quality of peripheral vision that that actually demands. We also looked at augmented reality and virtual reality. They're quite similar technologies. Basically, they're a headset that you would put on. You can see things that aren't really there in the world around you. Particularly, the augmented reality technology was amazing. When we design lenses, it's extremely complex and it's extremely mathematical. And generally, it's all in the past been done on a computer screen. But by using augmented reality, what they were able to do is make adjustments to the lens design physically with their hands and see the results that that would have and the computer in the background does all the calculations. A really new way of designing things it allows the lens designers to do things that they couldn't do in the past. So they had a problem which is the amount of time that we now spend on digital screens and they have a solution which is this new technology in terms of designing how the lens works and that's what's enabled them to come out with smart life lenses. People who stare at screens all day your eyes always stuck on these bright magical devices. Always on the move, always connected. Clicks, tweets, shares, likes. Connected to the ones you love, the things you love, to your dreams. Embracing the experiences wherever you are. The delegates at the conference were amongst the first to learn about this amazing new type of lens, but not the first because a wearer trial has been done in China where 3,000 patients 
tried the new Smart Life lenses that Zeiss have invented, and apparently 96% of them said they were better than lenses that they've had in the past, and not a single one was unable to wear the lenses. That makes it sound like a really breakthrough technology. I'm really keen to try them for myself and for my patients to try them and get the real feedback from our customers. So those will be available actually from now. If you want to order some Smart Life lenses, you can do that through us. And if you come into the store, we can show you what the differences are between those and normal lenses and how they can benefit you in your everyday life. So there's another feature, not just of Smart Life lenses, but of all Zeiss lenses, which is really crucial, and that is UV protection. I am wearing a pair of clear glasses now. There's no tint on the lens. They're totally transparent. You might see a slight blue reflection, um, but that's just the coating that's on them. Excuse me. So the glasses that I'm wearing now have completely clear lenses in them, but they provide as much UV protection as sunglasses do. And that is really, really crucial going forward because we are living longer and therefore over the course of our life, we're exposed to more UV. But there's a lot of misconceptions about UV damage. Um, people think A, that it's not that harmful, but we know that it contributes to some of the major eye diseases like cataracts, macular degeneration, and even uh, skin cancers around the eye. Another big misconception is that we only need UV protection if it's sunny, but actually UV has enough energy to penetrate through the clouds so wherever you live, if you're outdoors, you're exposed to UV light. Now you might not always want to wear sunglasses, but if you've got clear glasses on with 100% UV protection, your eyes are gonna be in much healthier condition. So Zeiss are integrating the UV technology that they invented, which was the world's first clear lens to provide sunglass level UV protection into all the new Smart Life lenses and all the other lenses that they offer as well. I think that is a really amazing thing. I think it's something that we should all be looking for in our glasses is UV protection nowadays. And I think that sets the standard for the industry as well. So thirdly, we had the VisiFit 1000. I did a video earlier in the year when I was at Munich, when I saw the VisiFit 1000, and I did a video two years ago, last time I was in Berlin, where it was first announced. But now it's actually ready to ship. I'm super excited about that. If you wanna learn more about it, I would direct you to our previous video from the Munich event, because uh, I had a full demonstration with that. But I'll quickly run through what it is and what it does. Basically, it is a piece of kit which takes a 3D scan of your whole head. Benefit of that is we're able to make the lenses much more accurately for your eyes than we used to be able to because we know exactly how they're gonna sit in front of your eyes. But secondly, they will allow you to see yourself with many different styles of glasses in 3D. And the difference that makes when you're trying to choose the right glasses is immense. Obviously up till now we just look in a mirror, we look very flat on at ourselves. We don't really see ourselves how the rest of the world sees us because people aren't always looking directly at us. But with this piece of kit you'll actually be able to see exactly how you look in any direction. You can compare lots of different styles of glasses and you can even see how the tints on your lenses can change how they look. So to know that that was just around the corner was really exciting for me. Last of all, before we close, I wanna talk about one extra thing which is very important, which I would bet the majority of people have never thought about when it comes to their glasses, and that is wastage. There is a lot of wastage in the manufacturing of frames and lenses, well, in the manufacturing of glasses, shall we say. Zeiss have taken an initiative which really vastly reduces the amount of plastic that they use in the lenses. And for us, that's a really big reason to partner with them. There are all kinds of companies making lenses in the world now. To my knowledge, Zeiss are the only one that innovated that far to reduce the amount of plastic waste as much as they have. So you combine a Zeiss lens with our eco eyewear glasses, which are also really environmentally friendly. You've got probably the most environmentally friendly glasses in the world. I'm really proud of that. And if environmentalism and reducing plastic is really important to you, I think you should come and have a chat with us and we'll talk you through which are the most environmentally friendly glasses um, and why. So I hope you found that video interesting. I hope I didn't talk too quickly. I am absolutely exhausted from the show and particularly the after party that went on at the end. Um, but we won't talk about that. If you've got any questions about any of this stuff, please feel free to leave a comment below, send me an email, we'll put a link in the description, or you can message me on Twitter or even Instagram. Thanks guys, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.
together.